dad simulator. Son, I'm gonna get some milk. Psst, get out left. That is the worst game I, oh, that's, oh no. Emotional damage. I... For anyone watching, this game is called Mystery Bots. <laughs> Uh, one of the hottest games of the week found on mygarage.games. This is a trip. Okay. Power is 97. You can jump. This is a cute little robot. I wonder, how do you program this stuff? P, is that power? My power is going up, right? Now it's going down. So let's see. Power going down. My robot. You can't turn anything on, right? You just run around. What's this guy? This looks like... Bring me all the the orbitals, then you will know all. Okay, so I need to bring this guy the orbitals. I'm running out of power, so let's... Okay, there's an orbital. Do you see it? That looks like an orbital. But let's get some power again. When I stand on this, I get power back, right? It looks like it. Okay. These little, the little gizmos going up above your head, that's pretty trippy. It's cool how, it's cool the effect just some rotating cubes makes, uh, gives the visuals, the interaction visuals. Then there's these cubes just flying through here. Do those hurt you? Let's find out. No, they don't do anything to you. June Tree, how's it going, my friend? We are playing some of the, the best Game Builder Garage games of uh, this century. Wait, what's this button? Is that a button? Kind of looks like a power button, but I'm not sure. So, not a lot of detail on how to play this. We're just we're just assuming. It says he wants all the orbitals. And this looks like an orbital? Am I supposed to kick it like a soccer ball? I'm not sure. But we're going to try and take this to the gentleman who asked for it. Because he really wants these orbitals. Orbitals coming your way. I brought, I brought you the orbital, bro. I brought you the orbital, and he doesn't even care. Okay, there's got to be something else to this. Can I jump up there? I can't get that. If that's an orbital, I can't get it. I'm running out of energy, though. What happens to my... Oh, ra battery low. Battery low. Okay, let's get some power. Oh, do I even want to know what happens if I run out of power? Okay. This is giving my power back. Look at those blinking eyes. This is fantastic. For everyone wondering, we're playing the hottest game builder garage games of the week as per uh, mygarage.games, which is the only place I know of that curates lists of game builder garage games. I don't know any other place that does that, so that's where I go. There are some really nice Facebook groups that I like to check out that have some good ones. Gamer Heralds, thanks for stopping by. Uh, if anybody in the chat can tell me what I'm, like, how I'm supposed to accomplish the robot tasks in here, I would love to hear it. As well, if anyone wants to share their favorite uh, Game Builder Garage games as well, I would love to play them in future episodes of the best. Okay, these kind of look like buttons, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I died! I did, I died. Okay, so your game resets. I don't know how to complete this game. Okay, there's a button there. It does diddly squat. I pushed the orbital over to the Tron looking dude. And I couldn't figure out. I think the secret is in this orange basketball. But I can't, I can't get up to it. Wait, those look like orbitals though. What are those? Are those new? Those baskets? Those balls? What are they? What is going on? Now they're moving. Something is weird. Okay, let's get some more power. I don't know. I don't know how much longer I can try and figure this out. Sorry, Lad03. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. I thought. I thought maybe it was. All right, we're gonna move on. What do y'all think of this one? That was the first game. I give it a B minus, maybe. Okay, next on the list, Dying Light. Play campaign. Okay. Up on stick to play campaign. Okay, so this this is interesting. These are what I see all the time coming through 
on the top of the game list. These are the, the intro screens to future games, so it's not actually a game at all. But this is the intro to a game that the creators plan on making in the future. Not really a game, but somehow I guess it, it gets voted high enough that it becomes one of the games of the week. Uh, I give it a, uh, I don't know. I'm not gonna grade these ones because they're not really games. But uh, there's nothing to grade it. Wait, wait. Something happened when I pushed a button. Okay. Like, ended the game. So that's Dying Light. It's, it's a dunzo. All right, next on the list, this is Just a Piano. This is called Just a Piano. How do you play? I thought maybe it might be motion controls, but it's not working. I thought maybe it would play the piano, but I'm not. Once again, this is another one that has made it to the top of the list. Oh, Just a Piano in touchscreen. So I have to be in touchscreen mode on my Switch. Oh my goodness, that's cool. So you can't, so there's no controller support. So this is just a piano. This is actually pretty rad. So if you had your Switch out in touchscreen mode, you could play the piano. That is actually pretty dang cool. Um, but take my word for it, this, I would rank this pretty high. These are called nodons. This is how they programmed this. So I can actually touch these different uh, nodons that are those keys that they set to be, uh, to use on the touchscreen. And you see it's a lot, it actually is a lot like Unreal Engine in that it's node-based uh, programming. So, so the creators actually programmed all this uh, in there. So it's a mini, it's actually not a mini, it's a game engine for the Nintendo Switch. They call it Game Builder Garage and you can make all sorts of different games. So we'll go out. Yeah, so we're gonna exit out of this one. Very cool, I give this one a B plus. All right, this is called Dad Simulator. Here you go, there's the code. All right, dad simulator. Son, I'm gonna get some milk. Psst, get out left. That is the worst game I, oh, that's, oh no. Emotional, damn it. I don't know how to feel about that one. This is a commentary on life. Let's check it out again. Son, I'm gonna go get some milk. Oh, wait, wait, what did that mean? I went to the right and I won. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Wait, we gotta play this again. So you go to the left, it just ends the game. If you go to the right, nice, you stayed. Oh yes, okay, okay, this is better. Look at this, if you leave, if you go to the left, it just ends the game. If you go to the right, you're a good dad, you stayed. All right, that makes me feel better. Uh, Dad Simulator gets an A+. Simple and effective, had all the emotions. Okay, this one's called Find the Farts. Let's hit close, let's check this out. Uh, everybody, thanks for hopping into the stream. We're gonna do a lot more of these. For anyone just hopping, oh snap. Wait, did we, look at there, the farts. This is just kind of the kind of beautiful thing you can expect on Game Builder Garage. A lot of fart, ooh, there's one. It actually poofed. This one didn't poof, this one just, this one just made a noise. Tag Showdown is very popular. We'll have to check it out. All right, how do we get to those toots? So there's a bunch of toots out there. Wait, how, how did I reset? That reset, okay, right. So there's no good way to find the toots. I'm not sure how to get these toots that are floating out there. I think there's one floating up high. You can see it. Shadow, oh wait, wait, here we go. Here at least is some platforming. So, what? So they did give us a reset button, but look at this. Okay, f find the farts seems like a troll level to me. Wait, 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 it is a troll. Look at this. What? I hate with a flaming passion games that give no readability or indication of what you're supposed to do or how you're supposed to complete the game. So this is no exception, right? So they put these invisible platway, pathways that I'm just supposed to stupidly play over and over and over again till I get to the end. Not gonna do it. I give this one a, a D. I give it a D. You didn't get an F because the farts were funny. And the, and the first rule of comedy is farts are funny. Uh, but this one fails. Okay, this is called Mousily 3D. Okay. Welcome to Mousily 3D. Try escaping this desert island. Good luck. Oh, this is cute. Okay. 
This might be the best game of the week. Uh, for everybody watching, we're playing Game Builder Garage. It's a game where creators can make their own games on the Nintendo Switch uh, through visual coding. I love the uh, background sounds. This is a cute little pixel art character that they made for this one. This little mouse leaf character. No trolls like the last level we played. Uh, but we're trying to escape the island. What does this sign say? Treasure. Treasure! It says treasure. Okay. So we're going towards the treasure. The platforms are a little bit longer. Big Jelly Gaming says, looks like a paper character. True. June Tree says, this is cute. Look at a Nintendo version of Scratch. Yes, a Nintendo version of Scratch. I don't think it gets as much love as it deserves. So it's kind of got, like, honestly, June Tree and everyone watching, it's kind of got a cult, a cult following at this point. Like, the, the Game Builder Garage community is actually pretty intense, if not a little less known. So those, the creators of these games are very passionate about them. I'm hoping I could just walk through those. These cracks are a little dangerous. Okay, almost there. I would love uh, some interactables going through this. Any kind of little pickups or little breadcrumbs to give me a little treat to go along. I always have a rule of thumb, too, with platforms like this. Which way should we go? Um, I don't know which way to go. I think we're going to go this way. we go to the right. Is I like it when you have like these multiple little jumps here. Have one occasionally be a walking and then a jump, a walking jump to, to try to change the repetition up a little bit. But this is nice. Uh, Big Jelly Game, I'm happy to play your, your friend's escape room here in just a second. It'll be our finale. It'll be our user created. I wish there was a sprint button. Hey, this looks like an angry platform over here. He looks pretty mad. He looks pretty mad. There were two directions. One may have been right. I don't know. Mousily 3D. Can we make it? Yes, we made it. Okay. Is the treasure over here? Or did I lose it? Oh, no. Oh, I can Oh, you can go inside these. Okay. And you get rewarded. And look at that. A boat? Are you kidding me? A boat? No! Oh, snap, dude. Wah, wah, wah. What do you think? Do I want to try it again? No checkpoints for me. You can program checkpoints. I am the checkpoint professor, and not only is that my name, but I approve of checkpoints, so I don't have to do this. Redo the whole thing. The whole thing is just bounces. I failed on the last jump. Uh, if anyone knows Big Jelly Gaming, they are a, a fantastic Super Mario Maker 2 streamer on Twitch. Uh, Big Jelly Gaming, do you do any uh, YouTube streaming, or are you are you only Twitch? What's your story, Morning Glory? Okay, look, there's a cube out there in the distance. What's that all about? Oh, you trolled me, dude. Okay, troll me once. Shame on me. Troll me twice. Shame on you. Okay, we're going to move off of this one. Very cool game. I actually give this one uh, a B-. minus. It probably would have had an A-, minus, but you threw in that troll in the middle with no indication. So this one gets a B minus, but one of the top games by far of the week. We are going to play Big Jelly Gaming's Friends game. This is called Skunk's Puzzle Motel 5.9 by Skunkotron. Skunk's Puzzle Motel. This looks familiar. I've played this one! i played this one before, actually. Uh, let's see if I can remember what to do. Use the left stick to move, use right stick to turn and look. Use the buttons on the table to enter the code. Um, I, I just can't remember how to do it. Okay, so red. Red looks like four, one, two, three. So the scratch is on the fourth one. So let's see if this works. One, two, three, four. Okay, that's yellow is, no, that's green. Yellow, channel five, so that'd be five. One, two, three, four, five. 
This looks better. Find the code, ring the bell. That's how this works. Okay. Is that my timer? Okay, green. Okay, it's either from the top or the bottom. It looks like four again. It could be three. Or it could be from the bottom. Let's try four. All right, okay. This looks like, this is much more readable. And then blue, uh, these pamphlets, two, four, six, eight. Let's try eight, That's seven more. Okay, there we go. Is this correct? No! Okay, so red, give up, hold A. I, I don't wanna give up. Does anyone in the chat have any ideas? Could this be from the bottom? One, two, three, four, five. So there are five on the bottom. Could the green be five? One. That's the hard part is it's so hard to tell. Nope, try from the bottom. I did five, but six, would it be six? Let's try that. Since you count the one that's clicked, would be number six. Holy smokes, I did it! Two minutes and 16 seconds. Pretty sure that's a world record, my friends. Thanks for playing, be the reason for a smile. Press A to play again, press B to exit. The late contender, this, my friends, is the hottest game of the week. Uh, I feel pretty good. That was an awesome, that was awesome. That was fantastic. Skunkatronics, great job. Anybody watching, please like and subscribe to my channel. Uh, all the support just helps me create more content. If you have any Game Builder Garages games or codes you want to suggest, add them to the comment section and they will be possibly showcased on the hottest uh, games of the week.